Welcome everybody to another episode of Let's Test. This time around we are looking at an upcoming game called Death Must Die. <laughs> Sounds a lot harsher than I think it actually is. I just saw the uh, trailer on Steam itself. Looks a little bit like a mix between, I guess, a form of old Diablo 2 meets Vampire Survivors, but all in all in a really nice refreshing pixel art style. So that's why I thought, let's download the demo, see what it is about, and just give it a whirl. So this is the House of Death. Wasn't expecting to find grass. Okay, we have attack, dash, and move. And we need to aim. So not quite Vampire Survivors, because we're not having auto attacks. So we actually need to do something. Okay. Oh, the dash is nice. Oh, level up. The goddess of fire. Hey, you're the one time gave the hourglass to, huh? Well, whatever it is you're doing here, I'm always first to help mortals, so allow me to lend a hand. Nice, so we can skill up, vengeful strike. All is level 1. Your attacks become stronger and apply burning. 22% damage, area plus 8%, burning stacks applied 4. Or meteor shower. Meteors fall from the sky, damaging enemies and burning the ground. Almost 6 seconds cooldown. Projectile count 3. 70 damage, 100 square area, and fire duration is 1.2 seconds. Breath of fire. Every couple of attacks, you breathe fire that damages and burns enemies in front of you. That seems like a nice little passive. I do like the vengeful strike though. An additional 22% damage. Alt for more info. Effect that takes 50 damage per second. Or for the burning. Okay, so if you hit Alt, you'll see another tooltip on the orange. Okay, they all apply burning, so that's not really a difference. So let's go with the vengeful strike. Okay, so far it's easy enough. He says to destroy. I'm not sure if I should explore or if I should just stick on the ground and just kill stuff to level up. I guess health bar. Don't know what this little bar is. Oh. There she is again. I love this sprite. This looks awesome. Whoever did the art style did a fabulous job. Oh, I am Summer, by the way. The goddess of all the hot stuff. Fires, volcanoes, you know it. Alright. Okay. So we're getting those two we had earlier, but we're now also getting combust. When you kill a number of burning enemies, an explosion damages and knocks back nearby enemies. Enemies killed 17, damage 46, area 400 square. And 85 knockback. This sounds useful. And a nice combination with the other skill that we already have. Okay. Nice. So our dodge is an iframe, which is great. Oh, so the orange here, I think, is our dodge. Yes, and it has a slight cooldown, so we have to be careful how we use it. So you can't just dodge, dodge, dodge relentlessly. <laughs> So Combust allows us to level up already, increases the damage even more. Or we have Path of Fire. You leave a trail of fire wherever you go that burns enemies. Your dashes become shorter, but you can dash multiple times in a row. That's interesting as well. Hmm. But I like the Path of Fire as well. Oh, those are all good. I think I'm gonna go with level 2 for Combust, because that seems to be so good, because it does provide knockback. Oh, what's this? How do I pick this up? 
Hmm. Oh. Oh, first hit. Oh, there's a strong enemy coming our way. I don't know how I pick this up. It's a bit annoying. full screen, then this would be a lot easier. Man, this is fun. Ooh. Let him feel the heat. Okay. So, Breath of Fire, Meteor Shower. I think we should probably diversify a little bit. So every couple of takes you breathe fire, the damage burns enemies in front of you. So, this or Meteor Shower. Meteor Shower sounds, sounds amazing. Let's go with this one. Vengeful strike, your attacks become stronger and apply burning. Meteor shower, so this would be on level 2. Combust level 3. Let's take another level of meteor shower, although this would be good. Just that base attack seems to be what we're doing a lot. this be? Oh, we even have an inventory. I guess this was the element that I saw on the screenshot that reminded me a little bit of the old Diablo. So we have a character sheet uh, and equipment. Health, damage to enemies at 50% life or less, movement speed and dash charges. Nice. So we can drop, we can compare with shift, we have nothing to compare to of course. And with right click, clip. Should we try and venture out a little bit further? We don't really have a map. It's the only thing we don't have. Oh, and I'm just noticing there's a timer at the top. Four minutes already. Not too bad for our very first attempt, I think. Oh, what's this? This weird black barrier. Can we dash through it? No, we can't. Okay. Oh, ow. There we go. Oh, adapt. Heart of fire, passive self. Your global damage is increased by 11%. Or vengeful strike to adapt. Your text becomes stronger and apply burning. So that means all of my skills get an increase by 11%, right? But let's focus on Vengeful Strike. Whenever we get the explosions, they are really impactful. So this was a good choice already. Those white skeletons with the shields, damn, they are strong. But nothing that a good burn won't solve. This 
one of those games where I would really like to have some form of lifesteal quickly. <laughs> there isn't anything just yet. It seems to be giving us health back. Right. something about skills. Dash, combust, meteor. Oh, it just shows me what I have. Okay, nothing else. So that's B. No, B was the inventory. Tap. Dang it, we got him. Global damage is increased, but just norm. Zip or meteor shower. I think I'll go another level in meteor shower. Oh, I might not be able to live for much longer though. It's getting increasingly difficult. Run, 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 run. Oh, oh, the damage. Dang. Yeah, those guys hurt. Oh, 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 oh. No, 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 no. Run, 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 run. If only I would know how to get some health. Oh, that was it. Death. That was our very first round. Not too bad. 7 minutes 36. 1500 enemies defeated already. Okay. Stash unlocked. Could have done better. We'll do better. Oh, where are we now? Oh, so it isn't the typical vampire survivors. You die and that's just it? Ooh. Stash. Plus 20 enemy. No, plus 20% attack damage. Minus enemy stun threshold. 24 damage to enemies below 24%. Powerful. Broken. Broken. They're all not very good, though. Powerful sword of stoop faction. Okay, so I can stash this one. I'm ready. He says. I should go back into the water already. Let me just explore for a second here. Oh, what is this? Am I getting out here again? Yes, I am. Back to where I came from. Can I go back in? I can. Let's talk to this weird big ass dude. Time, God of Time. As we said, hero, our powers will return you should you fail. We cannot follow you into the water, but you will not be alone. Soon others will come. Together you will succeed. This time will be different. Death will stand trial for their transgressions. All right. Okay. Okay, if I hit tap at the moment, nothing happens. It's time to submerge back into the water. Nice. Of the art style. E gaze. The irony. The entrance, the underworld on the highest peak. What do I do? Hmm. E? No. Nothing happens. No. Nope. 
strange. direction then. The scenery up here is morbidly beautiful. Okay. One more over here. It was a long climb. Glad I brought enough rope. <laughs> okay. So. All the way then? Yeah. further this time around, just to see if there's anything else out here. Again, it's a bit weird that there's no map. Feels weird because I constantly want to move with the mouse, but you have to move with WASD. God of Conquest. Hero. I task you with defeating death. For this, I reward you with my powers. Now obey. Oh, a different set this time. Krom, God of Conquest. Rampaging Strike. Attack becomes stronger, knock back enemies. Retaining blades spawn away from you, rupturing and damaging enemies as they are pulled back to you. Shurikens. Enemies you hit shoot out, rupturing shurikens. I'm gonna take blades. That sounds awesome. that I need to press E. Oh, what's this? Space warps around you. Hmm. Alright, goddess of fate. Now, isn't this curious? You are so intertwined with time itself that it's really hard to get a read on your fate, hero. Will you fail? Succeed? Or maybe it will be one of the others. Oh, sorry. They haven't really arrived for you yet. But it would be a shame to see you fail. Perhaps we could... Fudge the numbers a little. Mm. You move faster, you attack faster. Just deal 300% critical. We take critical. Yes, please. Damage. Big damage. introduce ourselves last time. We are the fates. Clo, the sleepy one, spins the strings of life. Lachi meshes them, and all that and I, Isa, snip snip with the scissors when the time comes. I have the most fun job. It does get tiring to see them all go through. All go though. Always, forever and ever. But maybe you'll put an end to that. Who knows? Okay. Fury, faster. Oh no. 12% doubling it. Oh, yeah. That <laughs> sound is amazing. That crunching. to just keep on doing this and not really go any further. <laughs> okay, Rampaging Strike. 
chart, your dash is improved. Or chains of war. Passive outcast. When you kill a number of enemies with your attack, create a chain that rotates around you for a limited time, rupturing and knockbacking enemies. Mm, that does sound interesting. Well, the chain doesn't really do an awful lot of damage though. It'd be nice if it would hit just a little bit harder. Anyway, let's carry on. Let's do a bit more exploration. Oh, what's this? You feel light? Oh, now we're fast. Oh. Must attack. Oh, that guy. That weird dragony thing. down dash charges plus 100% so I'm getting an additional one. Oh, but this increased damage slightly hmm War packed enemy armor is reduced. Minus forty percent. Oh, I like the new dash. Oh, there's something else now. What's this? You feel rejuvenated. That's what heals me. Nice. I didn't pay too much attention now. I don't know if that was the don't know if that was the shrine where we just got the other item from. So it might be that it actually recharges so that there's a new item coming. Although that maybe be too easy, eh? Now it's time for the blobs again. Shame though, this time we don't have the fire and that's really neat explosions. So I think this is going to be a lot harder than it was the last round. There she is, Summer. I've always liked the fates. You know, it's really not their fault how humans live or die. They just sort of document the matter. Okay. Burning, yes. Path of fire. Meteor shower. I like the vengeful strike. But I do also like this one. <laughs> Was it this one? Okay, so shift. Can we compare? It's the same thing. Shot pull area. It's the same thing. Minus eight health. Minus eight health. Okay. So nothing better just yet.
Oh, hello. Death's champion's approach. Oh, oh. That may not have been a good thing to pick up. For those shrines, but at the same time, also try to pick up as many of those green orbs to level up. Easy. Okay, okay. Yeah, I get it. really hard. I think we just lost half of our health in one go. Oh no, oh no. Yeah, I may have overdone it. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. We get it. You're super strong. Yes, you all want to kill me. Shower, let's do it. Or breath of fire. Okay, let's help us find more shrines, please. Oh, there we go. I think similar time, maybe a little bit longer, but not that much. Okay, Path of Fire, 21.2k damage, that's really good. Chains of War, mm, meh, that one we just picked up. Right, Re ooh, that's a different person now. Okay, so you even have different characters that you get to play with. Oh well, hello. I did not expect to live in Guardian at Death's Gates. I'm no Guardian. Just went out for some fresh air. I was told to expect others. I suspect you are the first to come. First to come? What are you talking about? It might take me a while to explain everything. I see. Alright. I guess this gives us an opportunity to try out someone, something different. Oh. Untop him. Do we go to our stash again? Because the time god is not around this time. I'll find you at. I promised. Oh. Ranged character. Alright. Oops. 
this here. This one is going to become more of like an aiming exercise. Let's go to the left this time around. It does feel like she moves slightly faster, a little bit more nimble. That may be just my perception. Bones to ashes, let's go. Zip, heart of fire, global damage increased. Let's go with this one. I just want to try different things for now. I wonder what I need the money for. Goddess. Ah, oh, again. The style with the crows around her. Nice. Hey, you've been enlisting a lot of help from the others, haven't you? I bet he wouldn't expect his own tools against him, though. Mind if I join? Mort's daughter of death. Yeah, I'm Mort, death's daughter. But I'd really like to see him defeated nonetheless. There's no reasons. Alright, deadly strike. Crows of pestilence or bravity. Your attack speed and skill cooldowns are faster. On ravens that attack enemies, your attacks become stronger and resolve cursed statuses immediately. Hmm. Well, why not? Oh, I now have two projectiles and they're green. Obviously the change in color makes them instantly more deadly, right? <laughs> Still two hits. Similar to the other guy we had earlier. Breath of fire, heart of fire. Global damage doubled. Eight to sixteen percent. Mm -hmm. Ah, the damage increase is doubled. But we need something else. Let's try the Breath of Fire this time. We haven't tried this one yet. I really need to pay more attention to the projectors that are coming towards me. Yeah, I didn't think this through. I think going for the Breath of Fire on an already ranged character might have not been the smartest choice. Again, liking the fact that they give you an iframe as a dash, that's really cool. Krom, Egan. I have granted you immense powers in Death's Realm itself. No small task. Show results. Well, thanks to it. Blades. I think we had them earlier. So let's do Warpact. Okay, so this dude now was a lot easier because we didn't even have to get into melee range. Well, that's good. We haven't found a single shrine just yet. Oh, there's one. Space warps around here. There we go. Morse again. I am morbidly curious what the other's reasons are. I guess I'll ask another time though. You seem rather busy. Swerve, your dash is improved. Your attack speed and skill cooldowns are faster. Whenever you overkill an enemy, there's a chance that it spawns a weak experience shot. Well, it seems to be good. Dash is improved, I like this one.
Art of Fire, Global Damage, Breath of Fire. Well, we have all of them except for the Meteor Shower yet, so let's take the Meteor Shower. More stuff to go boom. So this reddish V looking like thing is the one that we want to look out for, because that gives us health, which is kind of nice, not gonna lie. Yeah, I thought this might be tricky. further reduced blades or shurikens. Well, let's reduce the armor even further then. That can only be a good thing, right? Weak enemies means faster kills. moment, I have to admit. Okay, let's find another shrine, hopefully more with more health. Screen shots, dashes improved further, sickles of more terrible attacks, shoot out sickles that deal damage equal to a percentage of your attack damage. Thank you. 
that pulls in all the thingies, nice. All the experience shots. Breath of fire, meteor show, a heart of fire, glow damage. Indeed, a little bit more powerful, but only a little bit. We need some help. We need it quick. No, I think. The purple skull wasn't a good idea last time around, so let's try and not do this again. What a shame. Okay. Uh, similar again. Always a slight increase. 9 minutes 25. I think I've seen enough actually to formulate an opinion. This is good fun. I think this is one of those that's just really great to get in, especially if you only have a couple of minutes in your day. If you want to just, you know, go out, slay a couple of hordes of monsters, do a bit of quick progression, a bit of story, not too much. Again, art style. Mwah. Really love it. Really great. Mm. From the sound that I could hear so far, this is also something that I think is a real benefit to it. Curious to see what other characters there are. This is obviously currently only available as a demo. Uh, I haven't had a look yet, I think. But if I saw it correctly earlier, I think Q3 or Q4 for this year is when it's uh, supposed to release. Might even be a little bit sooner, I don't know. But um, if you like what you see, go check it out. Demos available for free to play on Steam. As you can see, you actually can get quite a bit out of it already. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed it and hope to see you again on the next one when we do another test. Um, but until then, thank you very much for joining me. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Take care. Bye bye.